You, uh, sure you want to do this? I have to get these shots. There she goes. Okay. Okay. Good luck. Thanks. Ah. Simon's Journal, Wednesday the 8th. When Roger's father made Jane an offer that was almost impossible to refuse, one that would take her away forever from the jungle, Tarzan had to help her make the most important decision of her life. Just hold on a sec. Oh, Roger, oh, I'm going to have to get rid of the water. You're going to have to get rid of the Dad! Hey! This is a surprise. <laughs> Good to see you. Mr. Taft, you were not supposed to be here for another two months. Yeah, well, I, uh, I know, but I had something very special I want to share with you. With both of you. <laughs> well, please, make yourself at home. I'll freshen up. Yeah. <sighs> so, Dad! What's new in civilization? Bad timing? Don't ask. Hey, you don't look so good. It's nothing. Years ago, I had malaria. And every once in a while, it comes back. Well, you should be in bed. Don't worry about me. I've got it under control. Hmm. I'll see you later, OK? The Taft Institute soon to be headquarters for a worldwide effort to monitor and study endangered species. Africa, South America, New Zealand, Antarctica. C'est fantastic. Well, we'll be starting small, maybe five or six million. Five or six million? It's a wonderful thought. Thought nothing. My people have already located a site in Manhattan. We're going to set up state-of-the-art mainframes, labs, offices, and from there, we'll set up a dozen operations like what you've got right here. I've approached George Simpkins, zoologist out of Cornell. That old fossil? He's had his nose in books for so long, he wouldn't know any more if it sat on him. <laughs> <laughs> no, what you need is someone with field experience, someone with imagination, insight. Right, right. You want the job? Me? Mm-hmm. Well, I don't know what to say. Say yes. It's all so fast. I need to think. Carpe diem, Jane. Seize the moment. Roger, watch your house for me, will you? I need to be by myself. Sure. Real <laughs> subtle, Dad. What is? Everything we've worked on, you have just finished for us. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I thought you'd be happy for her. 
Happy for Dad I'm never gonna see her again. Don't tell me you've got a crush on Jane Porter. Come on. I just don't want to get stuck in the middle of the jungle with some uh, four-eyed bad breath number cruncher, all right? Uh, well, actually, I had in mind someone a little more interesting to replace her. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. Who? Roger Taft. You? Junior. I am lost. Jane Porter, how do you get yourself into these messes? Stop fussing. I'm fine. I just need to get out of his clothes. <laughs> Simon brought this from a faraway land. Thank you. I'm going to change. Uh, turn around. Why? Ancient Western custom. Come on, just do it. And you close your eyes. Okay, Tarzan, you can turn around.
Jane is beautiful. I hope you don't mind. I'd like to take a nap. Jane will dream of the jungle. If you let Jane go, I could trash everything. Uh huh. And then there's Tarzan. You no. Know, maybe he hangs out just because of Jane. I don't know if you've noticed, but she's not that bad looking, you know? And what if he bails out when she goes? Not that I think she will, Dad, because she loves this place. Ambition's a very strong drug. Not for Jane. Don't count on it. Tarzan, I... I have to get back. How can you just go? I don't know how to explain it, Roger. Maybe I've been here too long. I'm getting careless. I'm losing perspective. Things just seem upside down all of a sudden. But Jane, you love it here. I don't know what here is anymore, Roger. I have to go. Has Simon called in? No, no, he's disappeared. Have you tried both frequencies? Yeah, I've been trying all morning. I better get toes in. Tarzan! Simon is missing. Tarzan will go look for Simon. I'll go with you. Danto, down. Last time I saw Simon, he wasn't feeling well. His malaria was acting.
Tell me Tarzan's wrong, that you're not leaving us. I see. Tarzan believes it's something he did. I told him. Jane Porter never did anything because of a man. It's not Tarzan. Think of all the good I can do for the animals in this new job. No doubt. I'll be in the center of things. I'll be able to make a difference. A real difference. Yes. You can do great things. There's the mountain gorillas in Rwanda. The Bengal tiger. Oh, very important. New York would be wonderful. A shower that works. Restaurants. Shopping. Theater. I missed the city once, Jane. I missed the rush. And the color. The sight of women so beautiful. In their dresses and high heels. And I looked at this jungle. At the birds and the trees. The ground is so alive with life, you can almost see it breathing. And I realized that out here in the middle of nowhere, in a place not even on the map, I was closer to God. see this. The butterfly, finally. It's wonderful. Ready? No. Well, we're on a pretty tight schedule. You are, Mr. Taft. I'm not. Thank you for your wonderful offer, but this is where I belong. <laughs> well, I guess I should have listened to Roger after all, huh? And wants. Like this, I know where it is if I ever need it again. This time, I definitely, almost for surely, got it fixed. All right, I was working on it for about half. How you doing, big guy? I put new plugs in it. It's going to work fine. Well, I sure hope so. Yeah. Watch this, Tarzan. Tarzan is watching. <laughs> Good, because this is high tech. You ready in there? Oh, hold on. OK, ready. <laughs> Roger, it's not working. Uh, OK, try the lever again. Still nothing. Uh, how about now? Nothing. Anything yet? No, not working. <sighs> that was good, Roger, but please, more. Oh, Roger! 
Roger! Roger! Very high-tech, Roger. <laughs> with field experience, someone with imagination, insight. Right, right. You want the job? Me? Mm-hmm. Well, I don't know what to say. Say yes. It's all so fast. I need to think. Carpe diem, Jane. Seize the moment. Roger, watch your house for me, will you? I need to be by myself. Sure. Real <laughs> subtle, Dad. What is? Everything we've worked on, you have just finished for us. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, I thought you'd be happy for her. Happy for her? Dad, I'm never gonna see her again. Don't tell me you've got a crush on Jane Porter. Come on. I just don't want to get stuck in the middle of the jungle with some uh, four-eyed bad breath number cruncher, all right? Uh, well, actually, I had in mind someone a little more interesting to replace her. Oh, yeah? Uh-huh. Who? Roger Taft. You? Junior. <laughs> to refuse. One that would take her away forever from the jungle. Tarzan had to help her make the most important decision of her life. Uh. Just hold on a second. It's not possible, son. It's always hard to find a douche. And two pompes d'eau, it's not possible. I don't want to touch anything. Your father? What is he doing here? Dad? Oh. You stay here, I get the bed.
I am not lost. I am lost. Jane Porter, how do you get yourself into this messes? Dad! Hey! This is a surprise. <laughs> Good to see you. Mr. Taft, you were not supposed to be here for another two months. Yeah, well, I, uh, I know, but I had something very special I want to share with you. With both of you. <laughs> well, please, make yourself at home. I'll freshen up. Yeah. <sighs> so, Dad! What's new in civilization? Bad timing? Don't ask. Hey, you don't look so good. It's nothing. Years ago, I had malaria. And every once in a while, it comes back. Well, you should be in bed. Don't worry about me. I've got it under control. Hmm. I'll see you later, OK? The Taft Institute. Soon to be headquarters for a worldwide effort to monitor and study endangered species. Africa, South America, New Zealand, Antarctica. C'est fantastic. Well, we'll be starting small, maybe five or six million. Five or six million? It's a wonderful thought. Thought nothing. My people have already located a site in Manhattan. We're going to set up state-of-the-art mainframes, labs, offices, and from there, we'll set up a dozen operations like what you've got right here. I've approached George Simpkin, zoologist out of Cornell. That old fossil? He's had his nose in books for so long, he wouldn't know anymore if it sat on him. <laughs> <laughs> no, what you need is someone. Sure you want to do this? I have to get these shots. There she goes. OK. OK. Good luck. Thanks. Ah. Simon's Journal, Wednesday the 8th. When Roger's father made Jane an offer that was almost impossible